What's up, everybody? My name is Fravis, and we're going to have another episode of Two-Headed Giant with my mono green pile. Um, got another video coming out. Uh, it, it Wow, people just take off already, huh? Got another video coming out um, probably, I don't know, a couple days, maybe maybe more than one day. I don't know. What's my what's my friend have here? Um, he's got one play, two plays. Eh, I got the land I like. I'm, I'm, alright, if he's got, yeah, if he's got the next two plays, then I'll, I'll have uh, a little bit more late game. I, I like having a lot of land in my hand. Four landers, I mean, they're a little more dangerous, but, I, I don't know, I like the safety, because you're somewhat less likely to draw land, even though it doesn't always feel that way, it always feels like you're gonna draw, like, if you have a four land hand, the next two cards on your deck are gonna be lands. Uh, that's what it feels like anyway. Let's see if it's true. Yes, it is. Of course. Of course. Why wouldn't it be? I can't play that at instant speed. Don't be stupid, Fravis. Anyway, like I was saying, I got another... Uh, oops, sorry, I'm moving the table around. That doesn't sound good. I'm move. I'm um, making a video. Uh, it's going to be like a review on... I get, I, I, I say it's a review of reviewers, but it's really a review of one particular reviewer of this game who I thought was uh, particularly let's use the word noteworthy <laughs> and, you know I mean whatever you, you'll, you'll, you'll see I mean I don't know exactly when it's coming out but I'm, I'm actually working on it I got a script going and a bunch of other shit so did I call that shit or not I mean two fucking lands right off the top I mean now it, it's less likely to get it but but uh, my, my ally here really has a good early game, so I'm going to focus on the late. Uh, that's a weird one. Why not at least stop the mirror? It's a little more valuable, because now if either of you play to put down uh, something two in the ass, that mirror is still relevant, as opposed to just this one guy. I don't know. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I definitely don't agree with that move. But um, I'm not... Uh, I'm not Mr. Opponent. <laughs> Who took off? The Bitch King! What? <laughs> yeah, man! Oh, come on, are you serious? I mean, technically not a land, but... Jeez, man. Um, I'll, I'll just, you know, I don't know. I, 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 there, there was a notion in my head where I would want to give one of these guys a Rogue's Passage, which obviously is not correct, but... Let's see what we can do here. Well, um, I, my, it really is a two against one. Unfortunately, that computer isn't doing uh, the, the most bang-up job available. I guess I could have waited a turn so that I have uh, Evolutionary Leap ready for this guy, but I, I don't think... I mean, the only thing that's going to pop me is a uh, Flesh Bag or... I guess a Language would do it. I don't know. I mean, yeah, technically that was a bit of risky. A bit of a risky move, but I kind of want to be relevant, so I'm a little motivated to just throw down some shit that I might not, uh, might not be able to protect. Gaia's Revenge going down. I, man, I feel... These two-headed giants, man. Not good. Not good at all. Making me feel real bad about, uh... Yeah, um... Yeah, that's the one. Let's go. I think that's pretty obvious. Uh, gonna leave that leap open this time. Uh, I, I, I want... I don't want to drop my 4-4. Four, four. I mean, it, it is a 4-4. Four, four. It's really good, but these guys haven't been doing anything yet, and it would eat up my leap. So, I'm gonna leave my leap open... And if they drop some enchantment, un unlikely an enchantment, more likely um, an artifact. Uh, at least I'll be more relevant. That is not an artifact. But it seems fine to me. Wow, there's some people talking outside. Hopefully uh, I can fix that in editing, you won't hear it. Okay. Uh, gonna, gonna... Well, when, when I... Wow, alright. Um, wow, pre-combat and everything, man. Alright, thanks. Uh, I, I guess my ally should hit the mirror. I mean, we were all gonna swing, you know, it, it, it's fine. You don't, I, you don't have to. Um, I guess it opens me up to Reclamation Sage, this elemental bond. I mean, I, actually, I would have preferred dropping Conclave Naturalists. Wait, did I put a land down? Maybe I didn't put a land down. Maybe I can still put uh, Conclave Naturalist out. 
Why wouldn't you do the mirror? Ah, I guess, actually, no, he, he did the right thing. I don't know what I'm talking about. So that thing's gone now. I don't have my leap open, but at least they don't have this stupid thing. So, unfortunately, this looks like a face roll. Which uh, might be a pain, but oh well. It's Two-Headed Giant, man. There's not a lot of content coming out with uh, Two-Headed Giant with randos, because, frankly, it's pretty difficult to uh, to get into a game, which kind of sucks. I mean, th there's a lot of things wrong with this game, man. I mean, not... Alright, I don't want to make that perception. There isn't a lot of things wrong with the game. It's buggy, okay? But the game literally came out, like, a few weeks ago. Like, two weeks ago, maybe a little bit more than two weeks. It's not that bad. And considering, you know, how recent it is... That's a terrible card. That's just... Why, why, why does that card even exist? Honestly, that's just a stupid fucking card. Um... Considering how recent it is, you know, the bugs aren't really that bad. Well, he's pretty much dead. Uh, to who? To who? To me? Leap it. That's a shame. Guy's Revenge, a little late. I'm surprised this guy's still playing. The Bitch King. I don't know what my, my ally... Fragnatic. That's kind of cute. I like this too, jeez. Everybody's got a good name now. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll just dump this guy. I don't need to leap anymore. I have Guy's Revenge like right on hand, so I'm swinging for a ton of garbage. Um, sure, I'll, I'll grab one of these because I already have a Reclamation Sage out. And there's nothing to pop anyway, so this game is pretty much over. Not even a Languish would save them. Still no Languish would save them. Um, oh, that might save them. That's, uh, yeah, you're going to get my 6-5, right? Or is it a 6-4? 6-5. You're not getting the 6-5. Guy's Revenge. Okay. You know, I'm blocking that with a 1-1. One -one, if you want to swing it. You do not. Actually, I don't have enough for my own guy's revenge and the uh, the rogue's passage, which kind of sucks. Ah, uh, wait, we might not need it because I can rogue's passage passage this guy, and then oh, yeah, this, who am I kidding? This is over. This is over. Let's all just put it down. Boom. Wait, why didn't you grab the guy's revenge, you dumbass? I thought you grabbed the. Oh, because you can't. Because <laughs> I'm an idiot. All right, it's fine. No big deals. The, the the flesh bag marauder still going through. I could have rogues passaged it, which which would have been the game also. But uh, screw it, I'll just drop my own guys' revenge. It's not like they can be they can be stopped. Look, extra damage. The guy just totally gave up, which I don't blame him at all for. Uh, Fragnatic and I unfortunately ripped this guy apart. It was a one versus two, so it's not really fun. Anyway, back to the game. It's not a bad game. It's not. I, and I don't want to, like, give it a, the sense that it's a bad game. It can definitely stand on its own two legs, you know? But it, it, it's just... Whoa, 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 whoa. We're doing two-headed giant today. Come on, buddy. But, uh, oh, this was a deck. This is a, a small video that I, I released just before this one, which uh, I was testing to see if uh, Esper Zoa and... What the hell's the other one? Thopter Spy Network work together, because... I know in regular paper magic, you can choose what order your cards go onto the stack and how they resolve, but you can't choose that in duels. So I needed to test to see how it would work. And uh, it works to the benefit of the player. I'll just, long story short, even though it was really only a like one, one minute video, but whatever. Anyway, the game isn't bad. And, and, I mean, there's a lot of criticisms to be had about it, honestly. Uh, but, I mean, I mean, how long have I been playing for? 94 hours. 98 oh, Jesus Christ, 98 hours. Oh, my God. That's that's a lot of hours. What's my ally have? He's got a very nice early game, so I'm going to hang on to the late game. This is super late game, but hopefully I'm... I'm I mean, I, I have one play turn four. He's got one play all the way up until turn four. So, we're actually okay. We're doing... This is a good setup. James E. Parsons. Come on, I want to see you. Frozen today. 
<laughs> Raiden1993. You're a youngin. I guess that's not really youngin anymore. I guess I'm the oldin. That's a terrible card, especially for this format. Or actually, no, no, it is, it's just a terrible card, because it gets hard countered right now <laughs> by uh, the Swift Fang. Or Swift Wing? What is it? Swift Wing. I don't, I don't know why you would ever run that that one card. Like, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. I hope it's not a flyer deck, because that would be silly. Yeah, dude, you, you go black and you go your bat. Black bat, do it. Hard counter. Although, maybe you should have swung with your 2-1 first. See if he wanted to block. He probably wouldn't block, since that's his only creature out right now. And it has flying... But now, if you swing, he's much more likely to block because he knows he can't defend. Yeah, you should have you should have played that. Oh right, it has haste. Who am I kidding? Well, obvious block goes to the two one. Yeah, I mean, in this situation, it's straightforward, man. Definitely do it. There he is. So yeah, there's a lot of reviews on, on the game that I, I think are, are somewhat unfair. I, I think it really focuses on, on people's expectations and how they weren't really met with the game, which aren't, which isn't really as bad of an issue as some people might believe. I mean, Stainless dropped the ball, but understand where they dropped the ball. They didn't release like a complete shit product. They just released with very, very poor marketing, um, somewhat rushed. It was still buggy, but honestly, that, that that's par for their course, man. That That's how they always do it. Every fucking iteration of this game that they've ever dropped. You know, it's always been buggy. It's always had connected issues. So, I mean, to expect them to just suddenly whip all that out of the door and, and have just a perfect game come out, it's unexpected. You know, it, it, it's not... It, that's not ordinary. You, you don't go to a McDonald's and expect, like the greatest meal of your life, you know? <laughs> you don't you go to a McDonald's to get some cheap, easy food. That's why McDonald's is around. And that's why this game is around. Cheap easy cheap easy casual fun, man. And you know what? When it works, it fucking hits its mark. It's exactly what it it I mean, it's not bad. It's not a bad game and and I'm a little I gotta be honest, man, I'm a little offended by some people who, who really expected this to be something that it isn't. Alright, you know what? I, I, I've got, like, a fucking script. I've got a whole other uh, fucking movie that or video that's coming out that's going to be covering all this shit. And I'm just dropping the script from memory right now. It's like, no, 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 no. I'm gonna try to edit it. I'm gonna have it nice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to make it look a little pretty. And then I'll, I'll just cover all that shit out there. And then if, if people are interested, they'll watch it. And if not, you know, well, who cares? It'll just it'll just fade back into obscurity where it belongs. It's not a big deal. It's just my opinion, man. No, you don't have to give a shit about it. And I'm I don't give a shit about yours. I'm sure you don't give a shit about mine, but we'll give a shot. Just idle talking, baby. Nothing wrong. So let's focus on the game, I guess. Uh, now I'm finally relevant. Um, surprisingly, my ally is still perfectly relevant. Um, if he focuses on offense, I'm, I'm almost I'm almost tempted to drop. No, no, no. He, he knows that I'll drop this, right? I want him to swing in. I don't want to drop pre-combat, even though I know he drops pre-combat. Man, you know what? <laughs> this is bringing me back to memories of. Um... Oh man, what was it? Um, back in 2015, we had. Was it 2015 or... Tw no, 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 I'm sorry. It was 2014. Back in 2014, we had Two-Headed Giant. And... And there was definitely a chat feature in Two-Headed Giant, unlike here. And I played uh, Dodge and Burn a lot in Moldaya. And my opponent, or my, my ally, would always tell me, Dude, drop this. Dude, drop that. And it's like, they were telling me to do it pre-combat playing instances on main phase. And I'm just like, dude, you, you're... F no. No, no, no. I'm playing Inspiration on their end phase, bro. Not not right now. That, that's retarded. And don't worry, I'll target you. It's okay. It's like these guys, man. These guys. These nuts. And and I'm, I'm just thinking, you know what? Th those are the same guys who are playing it here now. Well, some of them are anyway. So, maybe I should do like a video of just easy tips. You know, things that you should know when you play Magic. 
just like because because there's different kinds of there's different levels of tips that you should have or just different tiers of things that you need to do like tier one i'm going to say just go to the options menu and turn everything off even i don't have everything turned off probably the death toucher no the guy who was yeah, actually that might have been a good move too but now you're tapped out unless you have that um I don't know what it's called, that flare thing. Obviously you don't, because this guy would have swung in if you did. Hmm. You want to hit my death toucher with that? That'd be interesting. All right, I'm actually going to swing then. Should I swing? I don't know if I should swing, though. No, I'm not so sure. I can only play one of these things. Yeah, I'm going to swing. Let's be aggressive. Let's be aggressive. If they want to draw a card, I'd say that's fine. Yep. Well, I don't I don't know about that, man, because this this 2-4 can knock one of these guys out real easy. And you're completely played out. That's a that's a dangerous move. Ah, well, he's not even going for it. He wants to kill his uh, creature. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. I think he could have gotten well, I, I he's just doing it for the card, I guess. He could have gotten more value by knocking out these one two. Actually, these one twos are barely relevant, so fuck it. But he knows that this guy runs uh, auras, so these one twos could become relevant later. I don't know. Auras of auras, I, you know, you don't see this uh, deck very often. What do I want to do here, guys? I can hear my cat rustling. All right, let's see. Next turn, five, six, seven. Okay, fine. That's what I'll do. Wow, that, I'm gonna edit this in post, but uh, you, you, my cat is just fucking around inside of a bag, man. He's gonna kill himself one day. He's gonna find him strangled to death inside of a plastic bag somewhere. That's a relevant card. I'm gonna leave my death toucher open for that one. <clears throat> what was I talking about before? Something about relevancy. I don't know. Fuck it. This guy's got uh, renowned. That's a thing that we have. That's kind of nice. I, I didn't realize there's two ores of. Uh, oh wow! That <laughs> now I don't even have to worry about that. You gonna do that pre-combat? You probably will. Probably a good move to do that. Yeah. Well, these guys are getting fucked up. I'm sorry, dudes. Uh, yeah, I'm swinging all in again. That's just what's happening. Yeah, go all in, man. Definitely. Let's take care of these fuckers. We're coming in there, fucking smacking them around with big old creatures, and they don't they're not really doing a whole lot. I mean he's drawing. These guys just didn't do shit, did they? Have they been misplaying? Like, I didn't even notice this guy even like be relevant did he sack that to the bone splinters that must have been what happened right wow damage effect frozen today oh, all of them all three of them <laughs> holy shit all three of them are damage effects oh that sucks but yeah so like tier one would be to turn off all the options tier two is like always, always uh, try not to ever drop your uh, hand oh, i should have played the land after and then that's another one like don't don't draw uh, play out your hand. Leave something like at least a land in your hand, or or when to play things uh, second main, when to play things first main. There's options, man. There, there, when there's options, that means one of them is better than the other, depending on the situation. And people don't know it. Also, I feel that the caliber of players in two-headed giant are significantly lower than in versus mode. Or maybe it's just because I'm only playing against, like, rank 30s and up in Versus. And they tend to just, you know, have better cards and, and be better players overall. And here, like, anybody comes in for any reason, and maybe they don't have all the cards unlocked. I, I don't know. I don't know what the difference is, but I'm seeing significantly more misplays among all people here than I do in uh, in Versus mode on one-on-one. -on -one. So I'm I'm kind of I'm kind of off put by that. Not that it's a big deal. I, I mean I, it's fine. 
Shit, man. You want to talk about misplays? I'm, I'll misplays. I got misplays for days, son. I can't even stop them. I just want to drop another one right now. Oh, God. I can't wait. Let's play fucking concave naturalists and, and try to pop... Try to pop, pop this Nimbus Wings. Let's do it. All right, that's actually pretty good. You just stop those flyers in their tracks, man. Nice job. Child of Night. You know, there's very few lifelinkers in this game. I wonder if you can actually make a, a lifelinking deck. I know I, I played around with that idea. It, it's it's like completely pointless. I don't I don't know why you would ever do it. You don't win through life gaining. You would at least, at the very least, need that. Um... Sure, I'll take two. I don't give a shit. At the very least, you'll need that uh, car that white card. Oh, what the hell is it? Like, you have 40 or more life, you win the game? They better not put that in fucking Two-Headed Giant. That'd be retarded. I'd be real PO'd with that shit. Maybe that's why they didn't put it in Two-Headed Giant in 2015, because that card was in 2015, and you pretty much just drop that and you win automatically. I mean, provided that your opponents didn't hit you. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just talking on my ass. I, I really have no idea what's going on. Um, they have no death touch or anything out, right? They have no death touch. I think I'm just going to drop a Gaia's. I think that's what I want. Is he going to buff one of these guys up? Or one of my guys up? You could do one of yours. That's fine. They only have one flyer. But you're not going to get through to it. So it wouldn't be much point. I, I think he'd be better off hitting one of my guys with that. Yeah, because even if you swing with this, you, he's still going to block... And then you're just going to have a tap down guy. I guess I can hit him with this. Do I want to? Do I want to? Not really. I, I want to drop my guy's revenge more. I'm sorry, dude. I, I, I hope he wasn't waiting on that. I, I really just would prefer to drop my guy's revenge and just, just start hammering. I'm going to swing with everything, man. Everything. Even the 1-1. One -one. Ain't no stopping this train. Oh, that's just silly, dude. You see that 2-3 flyer with right there, right? Oh, fog, you piece of shit. <laughs> All right, you got us. You can hit us for five. Oh, wait, no, 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 seven. All right. Well, I'm glad I didn't waste my wild size on this guy then. You don't see fog coming, man. I mean, so obviously, that's not true. Sometimes you definitely do. Sometimes it's obvious, but... I'm not really thinking. I got a lot of my brain just completely turned off right now. I'm gonna go see the original Mad Maxes with some of my friends tonight. Uh, probably around 8 or something. We uh, we were so damn pumped for the uh, for, for Fury Road, man. I, I Oh, God, I gotta, do, I gotta do a review of that movie someday. Like, I know I just do magic content, but... I want to do some reviews, too. I like reviewing shit. I got opinions, baby, and I want to put them out there. <laughs> no, that's not true. But, uh, no, we got really pumped for Fury Road, and, like, none of us... There's a group of five, and, like, none of us out of the five have ever seen the original ones with, um... With, uh, that meathead. What the hell's his name? Um, Mel Gibson. So, like, literally, when we saw Fury Road, we all said, Oh, dude, we gotta, we gotta see the originals. If it's anything as good as this, we're gonna fucking just shit each other like crazy and uh obviously you know months later <laughs> we, we decide hey, all right this is a good day to do it so we're gonna do it today not that you give a shit about that but hey you know that's what's going on in my in my life in my neck of the woods um i, I mean same thing man same thing going on i mean can you stop it is is the question you got another you got another fog we got four fogs, I think. It's a common. Let's see what he can do. Let's see what he can do. I guess I'll hit it uh, on blocker steps. On, on uh, wild size, I mean. On the blocker. Do anything? You are doing things. Nice. Yeah, stop that 8-5. Do it, bitch. They're not even touching the 8-5. There we go. Yeah, all right. All right, figuring figuring things out. That works. Okay. All right. Good job, you guys. You did it. Nope. Oh, uh, wait, no, you didn't. Well, you did something. Oh, shit. Yes. Holy crap. 
Don't mind if I fucking do. Oh my god. That is a lot of damage. <laughs> Alright. Uh, is that lethal? I did not count that. Yeah, probably, huh? Oh, definitely. Yeah, it absolutely is. Alright, well, good games for my opponents. Uh, they definitely tried. Uh, not hard enough, unfortunately. Well, I mean, I guess none of us did. I guess we were all just sort of lazily walking through this game. <laughs> just sort of fucking around. Talking about movies and shit with each other. Oh, no, wait. We weren't talking with each other because we don't have a fucking chat the functionality in, in Two-Headed Giant. Oh. Darn. Well, regardless, those were some fun games. Uh, the first one was a horrible face roll, so actually that wasn't that fun. But the second one was a little more fun. It was a little more even. So, uh, thanks for the thanks for the watches and the views and, and maybe the subs or whatever the hell you guys want to do. It's uh, super fun. Love you all. See you next time.